Man, I really need another pair of eyes on this project. If only there was some way to stream everything I'm doing on my Mac to my coworker via Parsec. The Parsec team is back again to confirm one of those moments you've been waiting for has finally come. You can now host sessions on Mac OS, which means you don't gotta ask us if you and your team should change the way you work by adopting Windows machines anymore. But before we get too ahead of ourselves, we do have to let you know there are some limitations. For instance, you won't be able to pull out an old 2010 iMac and expect it to host with ease. And since Mac hosting is so new to Parsec, not every sweet little detail and feature that Windows hosting has will come right away. This includes no virtual displays, no privacy mode, and no 444 color mode. We're thinking of this as an early alpha available to everyone. We know everyone's clamoring for an experience totally equal to Windows, but hey, we gotta start somewhere. And look, you're hosting on a Mac. That's cool as heck. Now that the days of Macs only being clients are done for, let all your friends and coworkers know it's their turn to be your guest. Doesn't matter if it's Mac to Mac or Mac to PC, use your newfound powers however you wish. Let's say you've been a Mac only person, so you probably haven't been able to experience the full experience of Parsec in all of its true glory. So you could be even wondering, what powers do I now possess? Well, we're a handy little app that lets you work, play from anywhere, whenever you want. There's endless use cases, from accessing your Steam while on vacation, to collaborating with your boss on a very time-sensitive Final Cut project. And hey, if you're the type of person who loves gaming on a Mac, maybe even find it to be superior, there's free reign to host those sessions as well. Even if you want to remote into your Mac on a Windows computer for all your library needs. We won't judge. Hosting for all platforms is our overall goal, and this is a huge step in that direction. It's also a huge step towards getting Parsec on all of the things repping an Apple logo. 